So we have quite a few coins still, but there's not much we can do with it. That's the problem. So uh, let's see what kind of missions we have. I really hope we don't. Oh, okay, we can continue our march to Zufbar. I had hoped there was a little, at least a little bit reinforcements. I don't really have a full team of units anymore. It's just scraped units altogether. Both my cannons are out of commission. I'm not sure if we can fire with two units, so this might be back into battle. Dwarf warriors. Yeah, okay. Well, let's continue our march to Zufbar. Let's see what we'll encounter when we get there. Let's get the briefing. Our brothers at Zufbar are in dire need of assistance. I can pay you when we reach Zufbar. Alright, nothing changed there, so let's accept it. Start moving closer. Oh. Um, a march to Zufbar, so this is another march. But uh, I'm just going to take my cavalry with me for now. Wounded. So, okay, so I can use these guys again. But these guys are free. I'm just going to... I think this is just a march, so... It's not Zufbar yet, so we get held up somewhere. Troop Bruster. Oh, finally. Okay, so uh, uh, apparently it doesn't seem to matter because I cannot get my mortar crew back just yet. So we're going to hire 8 units of uh, Gretschbringer Cavalry. I'm going to hire 9 units of Gretschbringer Infantry. They're actually almost full. I'm going to hire 4 units of Crossbow. Uh, Wizard is just one of them. Ramon Black, nope. Nope. Saradon, who's been useless almost my entire campaign. Three Ragnar Wolves. Can't replenish Dwarves. Can't replenish these guys. Alright, that was some much needed reinforcements, definitely. What level is my... Uh, so I still need about 215 experience. For I'm, I'm not sure if I'll unlock the Flock of Doom, or whether I'll unfl unlock the Flying Bowser. I hope I'm getting the Flock of Doom. Because at that point, XP will ju just be pouring in for my mage. Gotta be careful with that too, because I don't want him to get all the experience. I'd like to distribute it a little bit. Okay, so... We had a little stop here. Not exactly sure why. We got a lot of reinforcements, that's, that's definitely a plus. Well, we got this. Squatter's rights. Let's get a briefing here. The landowner of the local farm wishes to hire us to remove a gang of goblins who have driven him from his barns and outhouses. They have destroyed his crops, eaten his livestock, and are terrorizing the area. He doesn't have the resources to handle them himself, and has asked us to deal with them by any means necessary. Right, let's. Uh, it's only 600 gold, so definitely want to keep my gold in a plus. So I finally got some units again. I got the crossbow units, 510. Hmm. I'm gonna keep the rest back for a while. Ragnar wolves, no. Might want to get my warriors are pretty much dead. So I got two archers. I got my wizard and I got my cavalry. What else? Um, well, war well, might take the Dwarf Warriors. They might be able to hang on for a little while. They're a stubborn bunch. Not sure if I should take my Mortar Crew, though. Does still put me in the plus, so yeah, I'll take them along. Why not? Saradon, yeah. Saradon is really just being a douche here. Alright. Done. Slick marching. Um, dwarf Warriors up front. Followed by the Amber Wizard, followed by my crossbow units, followed by the Light Dwarf crossbow units. And then, yeah, like this. I think this is a very small battle. Just some goblins attacking a farm, so how many are there? There's one, two, three, that's all, really. 
probably took a bit more than I should have. But most of them are free anyway, so that's a good thing. We got these guys, goblin stickers. Where's the uh, livestock that we need to get? There are sheep here. Stickers are getting slaughtered, which is a good thing. Fire! Any of their livestock could kill them. Where they go? Fire! Still no magic. Really want to try and take down as many of these. What are they? Goblin wolf riders. I know they're not worth a lot of XP. But there's the shoot. <coughs> but uh, yeah, I just want him to get to 2,000 so I can unlock the flock of doom. which basically renders them near invulnerable to ranged attacks, like uh, missile attacks. The combination of missile attack uh, and magic attack makes them really strong. Plus they already have a high defense rating from themselves as well. Come on, give me some mana. Okay, this level doesn't really seem to like me when it comes to mana. 
don't get any mana swing, I might just, I might just start shooting them with my units. Get my good piece around. Get my good. That's the magic item. Might as well take him up, uh, pick him up while I'm waiting for my winds of magic to give me some mana. I was able to get a Tanglin Torn off, which I think was really well aimed because it blocked these guys and <coughs> uh, made the stickers go, the stickers, the goblin stickers go around them. These guys charged into my uh, crossbow unit, so I'm not sure if I lost any there. But then luckily my uh, cavalry was able to route them out pretty quickly. Okay, I got some magic here, that's good. I'm gonna start crossing some hunting spears at them. Triple kill, pretty good. Throw another one at them. Wow, I don't know how many that was. We got three, so that's five of them. Five kills with one hunting spear. We just killed half of them with two spears, so... Definitely gonna wait for my magic to return so I can kill the rest. I doubt it will give me 215 XP. But let's see. 16 of them, two skulls. I might be short just a bit after these guys. I think they'll give like 150 experience. But since it's an easy mission, yes, uh, yes, I don't think we lost a single unit. Yes, we paid about 585 gold for all our units, and we get 600, so we still have a surplus of like 15. Which is not a lot, but then again. Free experience, I got a magic item. Why not, right? This might be the level where my wizard learns Flock of Doom. I do I just remember that I did also kill some goblin stickers because I threw a hunting spear at them. So they should give me some experience as well. Fortunately the uh, the Fangling Torns and the Curse of Ember here doesn't give me any experience. Good for another two hunting spears. So let's see, there's eight of them. One, two, three. Three of them died, pretty good. Just five left, throw another hunting spear at them. One, two, three. Okay, just two left. They're already trying to retreat, but I'm not gonna release these guys. Okay. My army is my army did recover quite a bit from those reinforcements. Except for the dwarves. Alright, lots of magic there. That should be enough to kill these guys. After I kill them I can instantly end the mission because I already got the magic item. There we go. Mission complete, pretty good. Goblins have been evicted from the farm. Livestock killed zero, so all of them were saved. Grudge bring recovery. I found a talisman of obsidian. Yeah, that's the anti-magic mad item. So we have zero kill. The warriors was just there for I don't know, just to look pretty. Didn't pay a meter, so Ember Wizard got 256 XP, so he actually leveled up, which now should unlock the flock of doom, hopefully. Or the Flying Bowser, which is not power. Um, what do you call it? It doesn't do any damage, but it can be very useful, especially if you use it against these uh, catapults, etc. You can just teleport behind them and just throw some hunting spears at them. The crossbows did pretty good 21 kills for 95 experience. Then there's the Light Dwarf crossbows, 15 kills for 60 experience. The Crush Bring Recovery, they took down the other wolf pack, 14 of them for 210. My mortar did nothing. Luckily, it wasn't that expensive. So, completion bonus 600. We could have actually lost some money if they killed the livestock, which didn't happen, so... 2,221 gold crowns left. Good job, guys. So, does that give me more reinforcements? Fortunately, not. However, it did cure all the wounded I still had in there. Because these guys were at 9. Now they're at 11 again. These guys are full roster. 
Um, some of these got recovered. These were still the same, I believe. Two and two. This one's active as well. Just one crew member, though, so... My war uh, Dwarven Warriors got five units in. And I think these were at 12, so three of them. So now I'm almost at full strength again. Oh, I know one of the upcoming battles is also one of the hardest. Maybe almost as hard as Shattered Pass. At least for me it is. Um, I'm just going to do a quick look at the mission. Oh, we still have a march to do, but I do know that once we reach Soothbar, there's two gates we can choose. And I'm not sure if it's both or just one of these missions, but you have to get your troops inside the castle ASAP. The moment the castle doors close, whatever is left out there is counted as dead. So that's really, really unfortunate, so we got to hurry up on that one. But I'll be showing you guys that in the next video, so I'm going to end the recording here and I'll see you guys in the next one.